Hi everybody, I'm Fatma from Addictive Tips and I'm going to show you how you can find empty folders on Windows 10. You can scan an entire drive for empty folders or you can scan a specific location for empty folders. It's entirely up to you. To scan for empty folders, you need to run PowerShell. And in PowerShell, you want to run this command that you see on your screen. If you want to copy it, you should visit the link in the description of this video. You have to change the first line of this command. See, in this first line here, there's a path given to the desktop folder. This path here tells the command which folder to scan for empty folders. You have to change it with the path to the folder that you want to scan. If you want to scan your entire C drive, you should just leave it to C. If there's a different folder that you want to scan, you want to enter the entire path to that folder. The command is going to return a complete list of all the empty folders. It finds each folder is going to be accompanied by its path. So you'll be able to find it whether it's at the root of the location that you've specified or if it's a nested folder. If you decide to scan your Windows drive, which is normally the C drive, it's a good idea to open PowerShell with administrative rights. If you don't open PowerShell with administrative rights and you try to scan your Windows drive, the command will not be able to scan certain folders. Even with administrative rights, the command will not be able to scan some locations, and you shouldn't force it to either. There might be empty folders in those locations, but it's not a good idea to delete them because they're probably system folders. I'll see you later with more tips and tricks for Windows 10.